Hello there and welcome back. So today we're finishing our first season in the Camping World Truck Series. We're looking to go out on a championship. I honestly have no idea what the hell we're doing after this. Uh, you guys are probably going to have to give me some feedback and tell me what to do. Because I think we're going to have a lot of options at the end of this. Uh, whether to... Well, you know what, we'll, fi we'll figure it out later. So most importantly, we go into the last race before Homestead and that is Phoenix. This is how it looks right now. Brett Moffitt is pretty much in. Johnny Sauter plus three, Noah Gragson there on the cut line, but then it's 24 and then 36 back for Kraft and Nima Truck. So, I mean, I mean, stage points could definitely help, but I mean, maybe Kraft could probably point his way in. Kind of depends on where Sauter and Gragson run. But uh, Nima Truck's probably in a, mess, in a must win, and, you know, Kraft and yeah, stage points are big. So, it all kind of depends on where Sauter and Gragson run. But, uh, yes, yeah, so far it's not looking good for Kraft and Nima Truck. So, uh, once again, this is the last race before Homestead, so uh, this is it. And of course, we're locked in with a win, so we don't got to worry about it, but uh, here's a look at our rivals. Uh, Gill and Haley, Remy, Snyder, Hill, and then we've got uh, two more there at the end, uh, Greenfield and Sargent. So, uh, once again, not too worried about them. A quick look at our facility here, 95 all the way around for our short track chassis, and we'll have 95 all the way around for Homestead as well coming up here. So, uh, once again... Here we go. We, we get that fun again since we're locked into the next round. We're locked into Homestead, so we'll probably come from the back and uh, see what we can do. Well, here we go. The Lucas Oil 150 Phoenix. So, uh, yeah, this is it. This is our last stick around race before we actually got to try again at Homestead. We got to try really hard if we want to win the championship. So, uh, here we go. And this is actually the first time we've gone to Phoenix, the new Phoenix, in our career mode. So, um, yeah, if you don't know, it's kind of backwards now. I'm assuming I can just kind of drive down here, right? Nobody cares. All right, I'll see you later. <laughs> can I just go home? Oh, hell yeah. That's all we do every restart is going to take it down there. All right. Yeah, so it just flip-flopped everything, basically. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, it works pretty good down there in the apron. It doesn't totally smack you around like most of the other aprons do. Speaking of smacking people around, how you doing, Dalton? Um... Yeah, the back stretch is now the front stretch, and the front stretch is now the back stretch. I'm not sure why they changed it, but it's just weird to look at now. It's going to take a while to get used to this, but yeah, we can still use this, uh, this dog leg. It doesn't, uh, it works, I mean, it works pretty good. There you go. I'll tell you what works really good is this apron. There you go. Mm. Just get a little bit enough to turn. Is Bailey Curry arrival? For real? When did you get on the list? Oh, 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 man, he's converted, dirted. He, he didn't quite lose it. Good job. Hey, Josh Remy. Java Shoes having a big run here. And P12? Better to be P13. There you go. How you doing? Hello. Hello. Right, Clickman up in here. Yeah, I don't expect you. I don't expect you to give me any room. That's cool, dude. Austin Hill back the fuck up. I think he wanted a shot at me, too. Thanks for the push, Josh. All right. There's Matt Crafton. Running P9, losing a spot to Justin Haley. Not what you want to see for him. I mean, uh, <laughs> yeah, if you want to make it to the next round, you're going to need to go the other way, buddy. All right, I'll make up P10. So I see, uh, I see no Gregson up there. Would you? Would you? I'm not. Uh, hey, Justin, we'll get that spot. Thank you. Oh, okay, you can cross me over. <sighs> Let's just take it down here. Wow, that didn't do much of anything. Okay, we got it. Now you get across me over this time, or can I just add the spot? You want to be difficult, don't you? There you go. Okay, we'll see it. We'll get tied here, too, while we're at it. Another rival. Golly, boom. I swear, it's just like NASCAR Heat 2, man. They just string all the rivals together, and I'm not sure why. It's so, it's it's just weird. There's something weird about it, how they always end up being, like, 1, 2, 3, 4, like, all in the string. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. You drive it in like a wuss, though. Yeah, that was your one and only shot. See you later, buddy. You know who we haven't seen yet? I don't think we've seen John Hunter and Eva Truck. Oh, shit. Is that? Oh, it is. John Hunter and Eva Truck is the leader right now. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Anybody remember back to uh, NASCAR Heat 2? Uh, I think it was NASCAR Heat 2. And something we did, Dale Jr. made it all the way to Phoenix in a must-win scenario. And he actually won the damn thing. I can't remember what that was. I guess it was career mode. I guess. But anyways, it was pretty damn cool. John Hunter Nemechuk might be able to do that today. 
I don't know. I'm coming. I think it trucks pretty damn fast. Oh, here we go. He's gonna, it's gonna take this thing down here. Let's see where we come out. I'll take the short way around. Oh, we'll gain a little bit of time. Hey, we got him. Oh. It's kind of funny when you, when we slide slideways there. Next time I slide sideways, take a look at that left front. I got the cameras maxed, and this thing is digging. Yeah, once, once again, it doesn't. Uh, you can't really see it there. It's kind of funny though, just the angles of the, of the wheels. It's uh, once again, them cameras are maxed, 10 to 10. Mm. Man, that's weird taking the taking the white flag on the on the old backstretch. But uh, yeah, here we go. This is just weird, man. I don't, I don't understand. I know they like redid the infield and everything, and like uh, this corner up here. What, uh, what is this now? Three and four? It's kind of all this like extra space down here. I don't know. It's just goofy looking, especially like if you ever look at an overhead shot. But yeah, it's weird, man. Pit road all the way out here. Oh my God, we've out flipped it. Oh! oh, can't kiss the wall a little bit there. All right, we got some stage points. It doesn't really matter, but big time, John. What the fuck? Hey, hey, dick face! I'll remember that. Anyways, John Hunter Nemechuk with the stage win. Good for him. That's very important for him. We're gonna go down, go ahead and get some pits, just like everyone else here. And uh, yeah, I'm just a skosh. But uh, yeah, we gotta be good to go here. All right, P5. So. Usually when I start P5, I get, I get enough restart. Oh, we're just gonna take this. Watch this. We're just gonna take this down here. Boom. We'll see where we come out. Man, third gear is really short. I think I took the lead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's up? <laughs> oh the hell. You know. Uh, what's the point? I mean, I was gonna say, you know, you, you know, in real life, NASCAR, you know, you're not supposed to change lanes before the start finish line. But we uh, we already know this game doesn't get the right rules, anyways. So, well, you know, what's it even matter, man? Oh, it was pretty funny. I tell you what, though, John Hunter Nemechuk is pretty fast. He's on me the last lap. I don't know, though. I still might be a little bit quicker. This thing's pretty good through three and four. One and two is kind of eh, it's not great, but. Three and four, man. Mm, that's a fun corner. Especially when you get a turn. Use a little, use a little bit of apron. And one and two, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> well, fast forward. We're, uh, we got about a second and a half lead coming around to the white flag station, too. Uh, the truck is definitely pretty good. I think we're a little bit quicker than 100 even truck. Eh, a little bit. But we're not totally out of it, for sure. He's definitely pretty damn... I, I think he just wrecked. What the fuck? He's wrecked in the middle of the straightaway. Can we get a replay of that? <laughs> I mean, he only dropped one spot. But, I mean, that still might... Oh, man. Big championship implications. We'll see if he goes any laps down or anything. Because usually when something like that happens, they're just, they're just done. But, oh, shit. All right, we're going to go ahead and pit. Let me see what happens here. A replay of John Hunter Neba Truck. Uh, I just kind of eat shit. <laughs> that's, that's the, oh, hello, computer. Yeah, that's really the best replay I can show you because this stupid overlay, you can't see what's going on because it's just in the way and there's no option to turn it off. But they gave, they, they patched, they, they gave a patch to make all the little things smaller, but not, not a patch to turn it off. So I can't give you a very clear replay other than that little broadcast camera. So thanks, thanks there. Oh, um, okay, Hunter Neiman truck lost a lot of spots too. But he is somewhere. Should be right behind me. Right next to me. Oh, there he is. Well, he's still running. So there's that. Um, yeah. I don't use this feature enough. It's because it's like on my D pad. And it's a lot harder to use my D pad on the wheel. So I like look around. I don't know. It's weird. Oh, look at this. That sideline rotate. Come on, Justin. Damn, gas on the right, man. That's that, that's that pedal on the right. You. you you come on boys i'm gonna show you how to use it today come on there you go and a hunter neva truck you had a fast truck we'll see if you can get up through here thank you for that this outside line rolls oh yeah we're gonna roll right into damn austin hill watch this ain't gonna give me any room oh 
Oh, hey, he gave me room. Wow, what a nice guy. Oh, he tried. He really tried there at the end. Speaking of that. All right, Dalton. Oh, man, he ain't a really good chance. Mm, I had a, mm, mm, mm. You're lucky. You're lucky I cleared you. And I'm a lot faster than you are. I'm not going to see the rest of the race, probably. Now, here's the next question. We're like three laps short. Um, personally, I'd like to have a chance to try to save it because I think I probably could around Phoenix. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> All right, there we go. There's Noah Gregson. Uh, he's in, right? Yeah, so it's just um, crafting and 100 EBIT track. So, yeah, well, say that's not looking so good. Um, so, yeah, Gregson and Sauter were the closest ones. I mean, Sauter's right up there. Gregson's right here. I mean, it's not going to be enough with just the one stage win for. Well, he finished first and then he finished third in the stage. But, yeah, once again, I don't know. I don't think it's going to be enough. Oh, wait a second. I don't know what the hell I did. Am I really that tired? Did I? Did I? <laughs> <laughs> I think I mixed the, the the fuel and the laps. How many laps have we got to go? We got 11 estimated. I was for, huh? And Sir Austin Hill, um, picture seven. We only got seven laps to go. What the fuck? I'm so confused. I thought we had 17 in the last stage. We haven't run 10 laps in this run already, have we? I'm. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda lost. Well, we're gonna have to step on it though. I was sitting there trying to save fuel for a couple of laps and then I realized I'm four, four damn laps to the good. I was three, now I'm four. I, that's embarrassing, I don't wanna talk about it. Now we gotta step on it. But Grant, Grant and Figure so damn far out there. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to catch him without a caution. Oh, there's no way in hell. Yeah, Justin Haley wants to ride me like a cock. That might be her caution. Uh, yeah, there's no way in hell I'm catching him. He is, he is gone. I could probably get all the way up to second. I'd imagine somebody's really dicking up this group up there. That's Myatt Snyder. What you doing up there, Myatt? Do the right thing, buddy. Just let him go. That looks like it's going to be a battle for second. It's a hell of a battle for second. A four, four truck group. Oh, man. We got a couple more laps. We got like two. Yeah, there should be two to go right here, right? Alright. Show you around. Oh, he can just take my nose off. That's cool, dude. Like, I'm not even there. That's 10 4. 10 4. There you go. I just helped you out a little bit. I just got you a free spot because I punted you right past him. All right, last lap. Stuart, I'm getting that spot. I'm still kind of pissed off about you chopping on my nose. You know what I'm also, what I'm also pissed off about? Getting clipped in the right rear by like eight different people today. Might you're having a great run, dude. You want me, you want to ruin it? Oh, jeez. We can ruin it. Uh, <sighs> Thanks. Well, Neiman truck had a nice little recovery. I don't think it's gonna be enough though, but we'll see. So look at the finishing results. Grand Enfinger with the win. All right, good for him. And a look at the, oh, that's not it. And a look at the, uh, oh, well, there you go. What are you really close? At all. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, wasn't the 100 even truck 24 coming in, 24 back? And Matt Crafton was 30 something, but 32 back maybe? Uh, yeah, it didn't change much at all. So there's your final four. Us, Brett Moffitt, Johnny Sauter, Noah Graxon to fight for a championship. Wow. Well, that's cool. We got momentum for Homestead. <laughs> this ought to be good. Congrats on making it to championship four. Go make it happen. Jeez, man. So, like, unenthusiastic. Congratulations on the uh, championship round. Go make it happen. <laughs> Thanks, Ben for your enthusiasm. Thanks for all the expert tips. Really appreciate them.
Let's do it freezing. You made it into the championship four. You got this. Make it happen. Oh, wow, you're so kind. This is it. You're a championship round truck driver. Hashtag, you're awesome. <laughs> Apostrophe at all. Wow, I'll compliment you for that. If I were you, I'd stay out of my way on and off the track. Well, that shouldn't be too hard there, back back marker. This is a bumper cars. I love for where. You'd probably take me out there, too. Hashtag, I roll. <sighs> I won't let that one slide because you're in the championship four, all right? I'm still going to beat that ass, though. It all comes down to this. The main event, the EcoBoost 200 at Homestead, Miami. Here we go. Last race of the season, 95 all the way around. It's uh, been pretty much good enough uh, ever since we've gotten to that level of equipment. We also get that 10% speed boost with uh, momentum, so uh, hopefully it's enough. If not, we got plenty of rivals to push us down the straightaways, so... Uh, we'll see how it goes, but I'm pretty confident uh, racing against No Grinson, uh, uh, Sauter, and um, and uh, some some other dickhead. We'll figure that out. Well, I have to qualify for one last time in the season. So uh, you know how it goes, man. Another season completed. Can't thank you guys enough for watching and supporting the series. It's <laughs> it hasn't been the prettiest uh, at times, but uh, you know we've. Like we usually do, we make the best out of uh, bad video games, I guess. But uh, no, nah, you know, it hasn't been too bad. We've had some fun moments. We've had some fun racing. And we've also had some bad moments and some unfortunate uh, encounters. But uh, oh man, that thing stepping out a little bit. I'm gonna have to tighten it up just a little bit. But I think the truck's pretty quick. Let's we'll see what we put down here in qualifying. But uh, yeah, so once again, it looks like they've got the AI kind of running the high side. So. I'm not sure why that is, because the bottom is definitely way quicker. I mean, I won't complain, but uh, yeah, man, if we got a lot of speed, which we never really had in NASCAR Heat 2 while they ran around the top, you know, it's pretty even because that, so now that we have actually like speed, I don't know, we might just blow them out, but I don't know, we'll see. Uh, P7, that's not too bad. They, yeah, they have up, up the difficulty for the AI, so I don't know, it's gonna be, uh, that would be interesting to see how we stack up against everybody running the top. Here we go. And they really need to have custom stories for, like, people in the playoffs. Ah, what a, what a scrub! Crashed and qualifying. What a scrub. Uh, yeah, that's it. They should definitely do stories on who's in the playoffs and whatever and how they're faring. Um, but here we go. So, uh, no solders up there. Crafton didn't make it, so who does that leave? Man, I wish I could remember. Um, yeah, here we go. We'll just go around the bottom then, I guess. And there's Johnny Sauter. That's all we got to worry about for now. Who let Austin Hill up here? What? What is this? Big time Austin Hill. Go get him, sport. <laughs> oh yeah, thank you. Yeah, go up, go up there where you're programmed to run. Thank you. Yeah, this thing's slippery. Yeah, it's a little slippery. All right. So here's a well, you know for a change we never really qualified really well at Homestead so uh, it's kind of great to be up here like early oh man we got some short stages too there we go we'll just uh, put a little slider off we'll get up to P2 so now we lead the way for the championship guys man you know what's really gonna suck I wouldn't be surprised you know I don't I don't think we've had that happen yet since it's been a glitch a, a known glitch and uh, since net damn pick a lane crafting bottom to the top to I don't know where the hell he's going. But yeah, since there's been a known glitch, uh, the caution coming out on the white flag not ending the race, I wouldn't be surprised, man, to see that happen this time around. Surprisingly, we haven't got that during the championship race, I don't think. I know most of you probably remember the David Starr episode at Homestead and the Xfinity, going for the Xfinity Series Championship. And he looped it in the last couple laps, and he had some problems limping it around the bottom of the track. Hopefully we don't get any more uh, instances like that. But, uh, yeah, that'd really suck, man. I, I just, like, because I've, I've heard those stories, man, because uh, it's, like, oh, it's just terrible. I've had, I've had a couple of people tell me that they lost the championship because the caution came out on the white flag, and then they just couldn't hold hold off. Like, they had had it won and everything. They would have won, but it's just terrible, man. When you have a game, when you have a glitch like that, where it's costing people the championship, man, it's not, it's not, not a good look, man. It's not a good look. But hopefully it doesn't happen. 
And, uh, because it looks like we got the fastest truck right. Oh, okay. We might have to lose this truck, too. But hey, you know what they say? This is fast. Yo, man. She's she's slippery. I tell you that. Mm, that rear end is is getting after it. All right, white flag. Stage number one. Yeah, we got almost two seconds. Frampton. Let's try this. Oh, here we go. That might be the move right there, since it's so. Oh yeah. A little bit of Larson line action right there. That's pretty sweet. I just held it wide open right there. Since it's loose, just carry all that momentum up the track. Since this track is plenty wide enough. Let's see if this works in three and four. Three and four seems to be even wider. Oh, I still got kind of loose, but oh yeah, you can use up all that. I think that's the way to go right there. Use up the whole corner since it wants to get loose. Here we go, stage winner, and it doesn't mean jack shit. Since uh, yeah, the whoever finishes the highest out of the four wins the championship. The stage points don't matter. But uh, 28 laps remain. We're going to go ahead and break it down. Hopefully our pit crew gets it done. We're going we're to tighten that up just to mm, skosh. All right, here we go. So our pit crew didn't suck. Got us out there in the lead. Here we go, Johnny. What you got, buddy? Come on, let me kick this thing to third. Mm, okay, we didn't. Eh, we're definitely pulling him right there. All right. They got the lead right here. Take short way around. Oh, yeah. And poor guys just have to run the top. It'd be much quicker if they were going around the bottom there. There you go. When they get the momentum, you know, block the lanes. They're already going to send this off at a three. Use up all the track. See how much it tightened up here. Oh, that's. No, oh, that's almost perfect. I might. I went up point two. I might take one out. Oh man, I just needed a little bit more turn. There you go. What you got, Matt? Yeah, it was, yeah. Had to back out, get up into his lane. Mm. That thing's digging, man. I wish we could use the top all the way around, man. That would be so badass. I talk about this all the time, but if you could actually like, if the high line was actually like worth a shit in this game, man, it'd be so much fun. But it's really not. I mean, even like the AI trucks are running the top, but. I mean, it's not really fast, as you can see. I mean, I guess it looks kind of pretty, but I don't know. It just looks so forced, man. Like, especially on the restarts, and they're all just, like, running those top two lanes instead of the bottom two. Yeah, this thing's definitely coming in pretty good. Oh, yeah, it's Brett. Brett Moffitt. That's the other guy. So we got Noah Gregson, Brett Moffitt, Johnny Sauter. Well, nice of Brett Moffitt to make it in the top five. We know Noah Gregson crashed during qualifying, so that's probably where he's still at in the back. No, man. That thing's still a little, still, still a little squiggly. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, man, that's so damn cool. It's, yeah, a little scrapey scrape to the right rear. Mm, getting it. I really do want to try this, like, top line right here. Just for, like, one corner. Oh, hell, yeah. Oh, that's pretty close. I don't think it's... I don't know if it's competitive or not. I think I lost the tent. So, not for what it is. I don't know. To be fair, once again, you can't use the high side in eye, in eye racing either. Like when the tire, oh god, the tires really chew pretty bad at Homestead and I racing, but yeah, it's just like the high line just doesn't work like it does in real life and I racing. So, you know, <laughs> trust me, I racing has their flaws too. Uh, yeah, three and four, man, you can't really use it at all. The groove does like widen out a little bit, but not much more in the middle lane and I racing, which kind of sucks because I'd love the Larson line it around here, but that didn't quite work. But anyways. Uh, end of stage number two. Once again, stage points don't matter whatsoever. But um, yeah, all right. So you got Moffat up there, who's dr driven up to third. Johnny Saunders falling back to fifth. Uh, Noah Gregson up to P11. Well, he's still got plenty of time left. Everybody's pitting. 20 laps left. Let's get some pits. All right, here we go. No spots, gain or loss for anybody. So Moffat third, Saunders fifth. Gregson, 11th. Let's get it. All we got to do is get down to a lead here. Come on, Moffat, give me the push. Uh, he didn't even really get that good of a restart. Hell, Matt Crafton just came down in front of him. What the hell? All right. Um, so how many laps we got to go? Eh, we got plenty. We're going to have to yeah, make another pit stop. All right. I'll catch you in half a lap. You have fun. 
Actually, it'll probably catch him right here, honestly. Let's sniff of that giraffe going off in the corner. Oh, oh don't hit the wall. Oh, fuck! That's it, Matt Craft in the barrels. <laughs> oh man. I'm sorry, Matt. Okay, well this is gonna get us oh, oh it's gonna get us pretty close to being able to make it, but I still don't think we're gonna ah, I'm <laughs> I like back in my rear view, man. He was like he likes like I think he hit the barrels and spun down pit road. <laughs> Whoops. That was I thought I was gonna stick that man, just not quite. Not quite enough stick in it. That would have been badass though, but not quite. So that is ruined Matt Crafton's race. Sorry about that. You know the cool thing about that too is I didn't even lose the lead. They called the caution before I lost it apparently. So there you go, Fred Moffitt. Welcome to the club. Let's see what you got, Johnny Solder up here. Now all we need is no Gregson and it'd be a party. Thirteen to go. We're looking about two laps short. About, probably about two and a half. Be my guesstimate. Can we save that? Probably not. All right, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, yeah, there we go. I'm gonna slide up. Oh yeah, there we go. It already went down to ten, so a little bit over two and a half. Ooh, man, it's gonna be a toughie. I don't know, man. I, I kind of want to feel from a burnout. I don't know. That's the thing. I don't even know if we could like, like we're on full throttle around here. Uh, I don't think we could really save that amount. And plus, we're not that much quicker than these guys. We're quicker, but we're not that much quicker. So, I don't know. I mean, everybody else is going to have to pit. So, it would make sense. That's the thing, though. We don't know if we're going to get that caution or not. So, I, I think what we need to do, we just need to run it. Let's just run the bottom. Save as much fuel as we can. And see if we can save a little bit. If we can start to save a little bit, then I'll commit and see if I can make it to the end. We can eliminate a pit stop, but it'd be almost a guarantee win at that point. Well, Johnny Sauter caught me. Inside. Inside, inside. I don't know. As long as we don't give up too many spots, I think we can save this. I honestly really do. Alright, yeah, we'll let him slide up. Oh, yeah, for sure. Especially if we get a little bit of draft too. We'll just ride behind Johnny Sauter. How about that? Oh, yeah, we can save a good bit of fuel in the draft, too. We'll just let this thing mm, coast through three and four. It'll take a short way around. It'll help us save the most amount of fuel. I think we can do this, man. It just went down to six right there. So if we can save up till, uh, oh, yeah, we should be right there around about a lap short almost already. There we go. There you go. Showing. Oh, yeah, we're still on five. So we're less than a lap short now. It just went down to four right there. So if we get that to go down by the back by the back stretch. Oh yeah, we can we can do this. And look at that. Look at the little bit of time. Yeah, there you go. Lead car is pitting. He didn't pit. I guess he's gonna pit here on the yeah, there he goes. Okay. I can't remember. Did they have that last year where they pit using the access road? I wanna say they they used the access road last year. Now they just kinda come in. Yeah, back in the lead. Now all we gotta do is just save the rest of this. I don't think it, oh Jesus. I don't think anybody would, that's that's a pretty long ways for the AI. I don't think they'd try it. I really don't, so. Well, Brett Moffat's still out there and Noah Gragson has made it up to P5. Johnny Sauter said he couldn't make it. And he came in, got some pits. There you go, he's gonna be a lap down now behind Ben Rhodes. Got two seconds to Moffat. Three seconds to Gregson. We're showing two estimated. Yeah, this is, uh, is going to be pretty close. I don't know. I think these guys might be trying it back here. Brett Moffitt still has yet to pit. Justin Fontaine at the P4. Oh, shit. Brett Moffitt might have said, fuck it. We're going for it. That might be the only way he can win it. And I think he's... Uh... And that changes everything. It's decision time now. It's only 13 on the lead lap. We have to pit. We have to pit. Four tires and just enough fuel to make it. 
We're going to lose a shit ton of spots, but all we got to do is beat Brett Moffat and Noah Gregson. Stuart, uh, or, uh, yeah, I don't think, yes, yeah, Otter's not on the lead lap. Oh, shit. Okay, well. Brett Moffat's behind us, so that leaves uh, Noah Gregson way the fuck up there. Well, shit. So we've got two to go, and I gotta get to the bottom. There is Sauter, and he's not on the lead lap, I don't think. We're gonna have to fucking send it, but I think we got it. I think we can do this. We're gonna need one good lap. And no rivals. Full send. Oh, man. There you go. Way to get out of the way. Appreciate it. All right, there's the distance. We all see Noah. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, here we go. We do have the fresh tires. I don't, I don't even know what strategy he's on. Oh, yeah. It's going to come down to the final corner. But I'm going for the win. Oh, hell, yeah. Oh, look at this thing. That 10% speed boost. This is for the championship right here. I want this win too, motherfucker. Uh, come on! Okay, we gotta protect. Oh, it's gonna be a drag race! But we got it! Yeah! Eat my dick! Yeah! Alright! Truck Series champion! And the win, what a comeback! Around the bottom! Yeah! Miami! Alright! Oh, can I go down here and make blue smoke? Nope. The game's not cool enough, okay. Yeah! Alright! That's badass, man. That was a pretty fun run, I gotta say. That truck is hooked up! Where's my trophy? Where's the truck? Where's the championship trophy? I see they have a couple painted right here. There's Xfinity. There's Cup. Is this the truck series? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, well, there you go. Let me do burn it over this. Yeah! Yeah! Now I gotta go pay a visit to my rivals. All right, who had a problem with me this year? Austin Hill, tell me how my ass tastes. Truck Series champion, lick my dick. Who else? Who else? Clay Greenfield, suck my ass. Truck Series champion. Dalton Sargent, what a penis. Ran like 15th all season. Always had to give me shit for no apparent reason. Suck it. Who else? Who else? Josh Reme. I don't know. I didn't, you were a rival, but you know you kind of had a couple dickhead moments. But Truck Series champ, suck my balls. Oh, Justin Haley, I really don't like you. What a fucking dick, man. Lick my taint. My Snyder, what a fuck ass. Eat shit. Oh, yeah. Mm. Eat shit, Gillen. I mean, Gillen actually ran pretty good most of the season. I want to say he made the playoffs. Eh, yeah, fuck you. Jeez, how many rivals did I have? Is that it? Yeah, I think that is it. All right, well. I think that about does it, yeah! Alright, now we get to go to the Xfinity Series, I think. And, uh, yeah! Alright, make some more friends and make some, uh, deep, yeah, hopefully win some races. So, Alright, let's, let's get out of this game mode. Well, look at the finishing results here. Grant Anfinger, Noah Gragson third. So, Noah Gragson from the back all the way to finish, uh, well, yeah, second highest out of the four. Uh, Johnny Sauter really dicked over his strategy there by pitting. Should have known we always get that late caution somehow, some way. But yeah, he finished the lap down to 16th. And then uh, Brett Moffat, yeah. I keep on forgetting about Brett Moffat, but he was in there as well. And he finished 13th. Okay, first, here's the finishing results. Okay, now let's see the trophy. Yeah, man, that's a big ass trophy. All right, 2018 champion. All the way from the Extreme Dirt Tour, now the big time NASCAR truck, Tampa World Truck Series. Big boy, celebrating again, yeah! Shout out to the crew for bad pit stops all year. Always lost me like 20 spots on the last pit stop, but hey, that's okay. We did it anyways, all right. Congratulations, you won the championship. All right, Ben, where's my, where's my video message from Ben? There it is. Wait for it. It's going to be like, congratulations on winning the Camping World Truck Series Championship. 
You did great out there. You got a bright future, something like that. Congratulations on winning the Chuck Series Championship. You did it. Oh, wow. That, nothing extra. You did it. <laughs> oh, great. Just what I wanted. Just what everybody wanted. Two more shitty videos from Stuart Friesen. What is NASCAR it? NASCAR champion. I like the sounds of that. Oh, man. That, oh, man. That kind of made me. Oh, oh uh, I, don't, I don't know what that made me. Made me sick, baby. Wow. What a close finish. Just wanted to say congrats. Amazing race. I'm sick and tired of your exhibition sideshow garbage. I'm taking you out. I'm taking out the trash. Now I'm, I'm Matt Crafton. Well, joke's on you, bitch. I ain't racing the truck series no more. I won the championship in my first try. Beat your stupid ass, and I'm out. Good luck. We've had our differences, but you raised me professionally last race. Fuck you! I ain't gonna see you ever again. You can have fun scrubbing it up in the truck series. I'll never see you again. Is that it? Wow, I didn't get any ass sucking tweets. Oh well. All right. So um, season four finished. Oh, the season is over. It's time to take a look at your contract. Sign with the team for next year. So we should get offers for Xfinity. I need to know. Oh no. Okay. Well, here's the thing. We're definitely skipping the dirt tour. Uh, unfortunately, I think we're gonna have to run the truck series. And unfortunately, well. Well, hold on. Let's see how this works first. I hope I can go back. Yeah, I want to race my own team, please. Start a team. Can I do that? Oh, I can do that. I didn't think I could do that. You need to register a name and a logo, which will cost you $40,000. Great. Hey! I didn't think I could be... I, I didn't think I was able to do that. Okay, well then, never mind. Yeah! Made a few calls and found some companies. I want to sponsor you for the season. <laughs> Lily Diabetes, tell me how my ass tastes. Holy, 100 grand bonus? Golly, boom. Car Quest, Black's Tire. I don't know, that 100k bonus, man, that could go a long ways to helping us get good, be good. Um, I think we gotta go Ingersoll Rand. I don't even know what the hell that is, but a hundred, a $100,000 bonus. Welcome. And we get to drive a Chevy. Need to buy a car. Absolutely. Oh, Christ. All right. Well, this is going to be expensive. Oh, Christ. All right. So we got to buy it. We got to buy a Speedway car because the list is so long it cuts off. Smooth. All right. I'm going to buy a Speedway car. Need to build your team. Christ. We're down to 36. What the hell is going on here? I thought she was missing a tooth. Oh, man. Hello. How you doing? Oh, my man. Santos. I love how he magically has different stats than, than what he ended up with the last two seasons. Man, they stuck her with the with the double prop. Yeah, I guarantee you, you'll look twice as authentic with a pit gun and a tire. I swear. Oh, man. All right. Well. Uh... <sighs> I mean, sure, Marie, welcome, welcome to the club. Yeah, Starcom Racing to full-time Xfinity series confirmed. Yeah. Damn, I still can't change my paint scheme. Uh, okay, so is yellow rims an option? Not really. Oh, yeah, sort of. Oh, that's kind of cool. I kind of want to roll the yellow rims, but we'll we'll stick to uh, we'll stick to the Starcom. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. I mean, that's that's probably the closest paint scheme we're gonna get to a Starcom paint scheme. So we'll roll yellow and black. I mean, personally, I think it looks pretty clean. So there we go. We'll roll that. Um, hey, we've actually got contingencies on there. Are they actually like gonna? <laughs> are they actually gonna be there like by the time we race? Let's get a head start on the next season and assign some work on our cars. Okay. Oh, Christ almighty. Okay, can we just get out of this? Because we're going to have to hire somebody else. Okay. Oh, that's right. We got that signing. <laughs> that's, yeah. That's why, we, that's why you sign with Ingersoll. I don't remember their name, but yeah. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. Okay, uh, we're going to sign uh, Andrea. 
Okay. And then we're gonna hire. Oh, we can't hire him. What? Well, that's kind of horse shit. Well, fine. Uh, we're gonna train. I guess you'll be, you'll be our arrow person. Oh man, that's a lot of money. There we go. Put you up to five. <laughs> All right, five. That's pretty good. All right, we're 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 starting off slow here. So yeah, each. Oh my god. What is this shit? So the beginner chance is like four hundred thousand, but the rest of them are six hundred and ten. What kind of shit is that? How much is it going to be to improve our equipment? Four million dollars? What? So you're telling me fourteen million dollars? Well, we're gonna suck this season. <laughs> All right. So uh, I guess we'll just uh, we'll go ten, ten and ten. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to have to, oh, Jesus H, we're going to have to roll with that um, until, yeah, we can buy another chassis. So, once again, we're not going to have a speed a super speedway chassis for Daytona. But, uh, there we go. 10 to 10. It's not really going to matter because we're still going to get a, uh, oh, Christ, yeah, because it's not, it's not going to match up. So, we're going to get a penalty. So, I think it's still going to be it. Um, oh, no, that's right. Our max is only 75. Ah, oh, golly. Oh, golly. Boom. Oh, man. Okay. Well, this is going to be yeah, this is gonna be a long road, but I'm really happy we could start our own Xfinity team. Um, yeah, I'm not even going to show you the, the truck series season. Honestly, I'm probably going to sim the entire season. I only put down the truck series just because I thought that I wouldn't be able to start my own Xfinity team. But, um, yeah, so we'll skip through this whole section. Welcome to the NASCAR Xfinity Series. Names are made here. I'm Kelly Earnhardt Miller, and I'm the general manager and co-owner. at Hi, the Kelly. The NASCAR Xfinity Series, the NASCAR no. Xfinity Series is, I guess, the minor league, if you would say, of most kind of stick and ball sports for racing. It offers uh -huh. a competitive like a stick playing ball. field for young talent. Yep. Oh yeah, young town. I saw Elliot Sadler in there. Need grit, uh. personality, and and just a go getter, determined. They gotta want something. Uh huh. I'm not sold yet. It's time to go racing. Thanks. You made it to the hot seat shortlist for a Martin Energy NASCAR Cup Series. This is the opportunity we've been working towards. Showing what you got. Sweet. Wow, new team costs for <laughs> Well, at least the good thing is we put down the truck series. I now have changed my mind, and I think I'm probably going to run the truck series. I'm going to run it. Wow, our, 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 look at that. Our, our background changed again. We have an iPad. Actually, that's that's uh, that's not an iPad. I guess they couldn't, uh, they couldn't really. It looks like a picture frame, but with like an iPad in the middle of it. It's more like a, an eye sad. Huh. Yeah, it's a good thing we put down the truck series season. I'm going to run it kind of on my own time. Uh, try to make up some money while we're also uh, doing the Xfinity Series videos. So a full-time Xfinity Series season coming up for you. And then uh, we're also going to have, we're going to mix in some Cup Series hot seat offers, which is awesome. So, uh, yeah, proud to say we didn't totally dick this around to where I had to run a bunch of stuff like off camera to, to get to the next point. So... Uh, it's actually going along very, very smoothly, and I really appreciate that. So, yeah. Oh, boy. Now it gets interesting, man. So, Xfinity Series at Daytona coming up next. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope this didn't go too terribly long. I know the end-of-season videos usually do, but, um, yeah, shout-out to you if you're still watching. But, uh, yeah, we got some we got some fun stuff coming up. We're going to be making our Cup Series debut here very, very soon. So, once again, I can't thank you guys enough for clicking on the video, and hopefully you enjoyed it. Once again, that'll do it for me, and I'll see you guys in the next video.